That's why the death cards, um, they feel isolated and they feel like choked down. They need to bring that, that, that lion within themselves, you know, out into the open. Right? Yeah. I need to read that a bit. Um, I'm just curious what that fox lady says there. It's number 14, which is a five. Um, the fox card stands for dishonesty. Oh, look at that. Now, furthermore, the fox card represents being smart, cunning, and sneaky. So it depends how you interpret this one, right? And, and this sacrifice is about what you interpret as being dishonest. I just interpret it being very creative and outgoing, right? And being uh, uh, loving and compassionate. Um, people... Yeah, there's this misconception of this Queen of Cups with this combination of the fox. The is a people person. Doesn't mean that you're a people pleaser, but you're a people person. You have a way of giving love to each individual in a special, unique way. Doesn't mean that you physically do anything wrong. You just love them in a special way, in a different way, by giving them that sense of affection and attention. And, and this doesn't happen because she needs attention. She knows who she is very well. For Christ's sake, she is the high priestess. She carries the moon. Actually, she's very humble. You barely even see her overly dressed. And yet, she's such a foxy lady. Combination like this, Shows a woman that is not like the empress. Usually she tends to overly dress and a lot of makeup or whatever. It, it depends. But this combination to me, she shows actually sometimes who, not even shy, just a bit reserved, introverted. And yet she has so much passion within herself because, and expresses in a different way, uh, the love that she gives to others. Uh, sometimes when it comes to timing, it stands, it stands for wrong timing or for a not at all, a familiar person, a particular smart or insidious person. Okay. Not avoiding important responsibilities such as caring for one's own family. Stop pretending and fooling yourself. Being betrayed. Lack of trust or respect. Do not be blinded. The fox card is asking you to be real and authentic. Exactly. This is where I was going. There's this misconception. And you either feel like you have to sacrifice something, your identity. And your identity is made of multiple layers. And that's unfortunately like the wheel of fortune. Like... There's so many, is you revealing constantly different part of yourself and that makes you as a whole um, and you cannot give up any of those because then you feel imbalanced. You're not yourself. Wow. Yeah, our authenticity. Hard work, being clever, cunning and vigilant. Do not be fooled again. The fox is like a mask that is worn. The real self remains unseen. So sometimes it's all a big show. The fox has to be strong and show love and affection to others to give them hope and the desire for life and the passion for life. But um, with all this uh, high priestess element in the moon, you never know the real her. The fragility, the humbleness, the simplicity, the, the nurturing, the, yeah, the hardworking person, you know, that, uh, yeah. <clears throat> and someone like this is living, uh, yeah, a distorted life without finding happiness. So this is the distorted life when you're not being authentic. Yeah, this is what it's saying. 
you got to expose your true self. Uh, the card is an invitation to search for your own uh, really important things. So what is important to you? For, for me, oh my God, 38 minutes. Uh, important is to, yeah, to be myself. And, uh, and that is not always the happen because I have to be what other people expect me to be. Whenever I say something, I have to watch what I have to say because people are always there to judge me and, and overanalyze and attack me or defend and protect somebody else. So there's always some ulterior motives. And, you know, I play the game how other people want the game to be played. I have to compile with that and have to detach when they want to detach this, this, um, a, and it's hard to, to work like that or even to interact with people like that because it's not genuine. It's, it's very filtered and it's very programmed and makes you very unhappy. You Fox lady is so authentic and her deep feelings needs to be exposed a hundred percent. She, that's she, how she does it. She loves deeply and that's unfortunate um, that she has to put that a mask of being playful and joyful or in you know just to make people happy and 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 to put the game that they want to make them feel safe because there's a sense of threat when she's around um all right so yes, that's the main message for you guys. Thank you so much, guys. This was 40 minutes. I apologize. <laughs> I'll see you on the next reading. Bye.